What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Jolin and we back at it with another episode of Unstocked. The show where I take you in my closet each week to let you see the shoes that I've been rocking, what I've been stocking, and I'm even let you know what I've been thinking about getting. But before we do any of that, I'ma need you to make sure you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that like button, and if you really like the video, make sure you hit that notification bell so you can join the gang so you can know what I'm doing when I do it. Let's get into it. So the next shoe I decided to break out the closet and review for y'all is actually a shoe that came out last week. Now, if you paid attention to Jordan's history, you already know that back in the day, Jordan used to play basketball for North Carolina, and that's kind of where he got his, his foot in the game, I guess you could say. Now, if you got a lot of Jordans like I do, you already know that the main colorways that you get for some of the original Jordans is black and red or white and red. But every so often, you already know that the Jordan brand also commemorate some of their shoes for Jordan's college days. Now, back in 2000, I want to say 18, the Jordan brand decided to give a couple of the best teams around some PE additions. I'm from Portland. I know that I've seen various different PE uh, additions for Oregon State. You feel me? So that's pretty dope. But these, I'm not, I'm going to tell you off the bat. These aren't the player edition ones, but last week they ended up coming out with some you know some general public ones for the people I know a lot of people were excited for these I know some people wish they would have been the player exclusive ones but nonetheless I got my hands on them so shout out to my bro Shalom for actually getting me these but let's talk more show I'd rather break out these motherfucking North Carolina exclusive threes let's check it out all right so off the rip let me show you this box you know how I do off the rip, the box ain't nothing too spectacular, you feel me? If you got some threes in your closet, you already know that this is kind of like the box that they've been going with for some time, you feel me? It got like that elephant print on the bottom and then they'll change up the colorway depending on what shoe it is to kind of match the box and go with the shoe. So yeah, man, that's pretty much the box. Ooh, slide the top right off, you feel me? Red inside. So, these is them joints right here. You feel me? These motherfuckers is clean, clean. Now, I usually don't do a whole lot of blue shoes, but like I said, if it's a part of Jordan's history, I usually just put it to the side, and these are definitely, definitely, definitely a dope shoe. You feel me? They just too clean, you feel me? I feel like if I'm walking around, I might motherfucking just drop something on them. You feel me? It got that elephant print on there. Now, I've noticed that the Jordan brand has been kind of lowering, lowering how high that they've been putting that cement on there. And that's cool with me. I don't really mind. But yeah, man, these boys is clean. Take a look at that motherfucking, that's like a a blackish, I don't I don't want to say that that's all the way black, but it's a black navy-ish Jordan Jumpman on the back. It got that baby blue with the motherfucking navy blue background Jordan on the front. And then they got that, ooh, wee, that red thing. Now, I know on the player exclusive ones, they had a different insert that's in the shoe. These ones are red. I know that the other ones were kind of like a, I don't want to call it a plaid, but it kind of looked like the print that motherfucking golfers use. I don't know. I guess you can kind of call it plaid, but yeah, man. These are pretty cool. You feel me? Oh, I didn't show y'all the background. Bam. Let me show y'all the other one. These ones is, these ones is cool. They're not my favorite ones. Like some of my favorite threes, I like like the black cements or I like the motherfucking fire red joints, but I would definitely say that these are dope. Uh, another difference about the PE version versus these ones is that Jordan Jumpman on the front. Now, if you had the player exclusive ones, those ones actually come with the North Carolina logo on the tongue. Now, like I said, these ones just came out about a week ago. By the time some of you guys might watch this video, they'll probably be about mm, two weeks old. You feel me? So fairly, fairly new. I know that the motherfucking, the PE version of these, right now they're on StockX and Goat and stuff like that. And they're going for around $4,000 
for some real ones. Now, I know people might have some knockoff joints. They might be trying to sell them to y'all for the 350 or whatnot. But if you want a real deal pair of the motherfucking PE exclusive ones, it's going to run you about four stacks. But these, on the other hand, if you don't mind paying for them, they only marked them up about 60 bucks. The retail on these joints was only 190. I seen them on motherfucking Go and StockX going for 240, 250. I think the highest that I seen was about 270, just depending on your size. But like I always tell y'all, it's good to get it from these reliable sources just because you don't want to be paying that top dollar and getting a knockoff pair of shoes, you feel me? Cuz niggas don't want to be walking around in them fake joints, you feel me? A funny story about motherfucking threes like i said i feel like with all of this white on them a nigga would drop something i remember back in the day when the fire reds came out i want to say maybe 2006 2007 ish i had a pair you feel me my cousin had went to the motherfucking taco bell i asked this nigga to get me a, a motherfucking chalupa or something this nigga pulls back up like Oh, I ran out of money. Sorry, Cuddy. So I snatched this nigga's burrito, and as soon as I bite the burrito, I ended up dropping some motherfucking Taco Bell meat all over the sides of these joints, and it stained the motherfucking threading all around the shoe. I mean, it wasn't too, too bad, but it was crazy because it was the first time that I had rocked these motherfuckers, though. You feel me? So that's a crazy story about the threes. Another thing that I would say about the threes, they're super dope, but if you know like I know and you actually wear your shoes, once you start walking in them, this part right here begins to crack. That whole bottom just starts to crack. I mean, this upper part also is probably gonna start cracking, but I mean, like I said, that's if you wear them a lot and throughout time, you know, the shoes kind of just deteriorate and shit like that. So, I mean, they gonna hold up, but if you're gonna be hooping in them, you, you probably gonna see the difference in the back of that sole, you feel me? But off top, you already know, what y'all think of these shoes right here? Do y'all think this, this is more for the hooping or for the drip? You feel me? I personally think that these is for both. You feel me? The motherfucking Jordan 3s is always a good shoe to hoop in. I don't know if I would personally pick these, but if you a hooper, I can definitely say that this is going to be a good shoe. Also, another thing that I'm noticing about these joints before I get off of here, look at that that tumble leather on there that shit just look real real nice and icy i know that the nike brand i want to say that they might have switched up the leather that they've been using i've been seeing some of the jordan and the leather on them joints just been popping so shout out to nike for that and shout out to nike for these you feel me like i said if you want the player exclusive ones if you got that money like that go drop that four racks but if you just want these right here you can still get them i'm, I'm not sure if you can get them at champs and Foot Locker still i heard that there was a big line to try to get these but nonetheless you can still get them for around 250 just depending on your size so just go on a reliable source and copy these if you like these motherfuckers oh yeah let me show y'all what's inside the box though like i said it got like some cement type motherfucking paper in there just so y'all see we got these motherfuckers at champ sports you can see that bam nothing really to it red inside but yeah man these motherfucking shoes off the rip it's some motherfucking flame like i said shout out to my bro shalom for letting me hold these to to review for y'all i don't know if i would necessarily get them for my collection i already got a couple pairs of threes that i'll be rocking consistently so these is cool but i don't know if they're gonna get into the collection but yeah man that's kind of oh wait 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 before we get up out of here now these ones right here is another thing that i noticed between these and the pe's i want to say that the pe's right here i don't know if you can see that it actually says soul on it i want to say that the pe version it says unc and i want to say it might say jordan on it so that's another little thing that I noticed just off of looking. I didn't pop this box open and go over the shoe. I'm just kind of looking at them and kind of just giving y'all my first reaction, letting y'all know what I think of the shoe, telling y'all a little bit of what I know about the shoe. So yeah, man, there's subtle little differences, but I don't know. I didn't hoop for North Carolina, so I don't really need the motherfucking player exclusive joints. But if I really, really wanted them, I would definitely say that these are still cool for the little 250, you feel me? But nonetheless, man, 
that's pretty much all I gotta say about these shoes. So as always, if you like the video, make sure you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that like button, and leave me some shoes in the comments. You already know that there's a lot of heat that's gonna be dropping. Let me know what y'all gonna be stocking on, passing on, what you might've already got, and what you looking to get. So until next time, you already know what it is. It's Jolin, it's Varsity, peace. I'm getting higher, yeah, fly like a pilot. Yeah. My niggas violent, they is. Let us stay silent. Shh. My bitch is styling. Work. Pussy be kayin'. Yeah. These up, post down. Bitch, what a party, yeah.